Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel, SciTechGuru. In this video, I'll let you go to the PUBG Mobile 1.690 FPS gameplay support test in the MI Linux device. Yes friends, right now I do have the MI Linux device with the Snapdragon 870 chipset. Let's see, with the latest update from the PUBG Mobile, whether this phone will be able to support the 90 FPS or not graphics. That's what I'm going to exactly demonstrate in this video. Let me need to open the PUBG Mobile right now. And in case if you want to know about other details about other phones, how they got update or not 90 FPS. So try to check the playlist which I have created friends. The playlist will be on the top as you can see. Try to click on the playlist and then you can find all the videos which I did on the plenty of other phones as you can see here. So you can check which phones has got the 90 FPS and which phone did not get the 90 FPS. Right now as you can see clearly which says the version 1.6.0.1 .1. and let me need to do the login thing and everything and uh, accepting all. Again I will be back once everything is done. Right now it's checking for updates and let me need to do the login again. So right now it's kind of compelling the resources. So it's going to take some time. So let's see. I'm very curious friends. As I said, this is my first time I'm trying to do in front of the camera. Even I don't have any clue whether this phone will be able to support or not. I mean uh, with the 90 FPS. So that's the kind of thing which we all did expect. PUBG 1.6 if it's get the 90 FPS, the Badugans version also 1.6 will also get the 90 FPS. That is all of the users who are having the MI Linux device. That is the expectations. But let's see whether uh, we can actually play it or not. So even I am really interested to see. And let me know in the conversation below what other uh, reviews you, you want me to cover on this phone. And one more thing, the few of the users that are not receiving the MI UI 12.5 enhanced update. And that's the thing got postponed a little bit because of the few issues with the reboot problems. So it's gonna take some time. So here comes the final result of the MLX device and it's loading at this moment and uh, it's my first time doing this kind of testing. So let's see, let me need to go back to the settings and I'll let you do the complete gameplay later on but just a just small demonstration to show the initial things about the graphics, what are the graphics we got. And let's see about the graphics, one, two, three. And there's some network, let me try to connect to the network properly. And final friends is the result and even the ML Linux also didn't get any kind of 90 FPS update at this moment. Yes, there's no 90 FPS update unfortunately. The phone did not receive at this point and you can see clearly friends. With the PUBG version 1.6 APK which I am trying to use. This APK doesn't have a 90 FPS update. No, exactly. So this kind of, uh, kind of drawback and I did not expect. I thought the PUBG 1.6 will be able to support few of the phones with the 90 FPS like MI Linux device and other phones but this is not the case. So that's, that's it friends, this is a quick review on the MI Linux device with nothing much more, more to talk about. Definitely I'll try to do the another gameplay review. So playing the drop test and all those things I'll definitely test as soon as possible today. So this is a small video which a lot of users are actually eagerly waiting. They want the answer that whether this phone supports or not. That's the reason I thought of making this short video which I thought of keeping only within that three minutes of time frame, three to four minutes of time frame. This is a quick, quick review friends and thank you for watching this video and in case if you have any other queries, let me know in the comment section below. Definitely, I'll be able to do those kind of testings in other smartphones or maybe in this phone. See you in the next video friends and let's for more updates. Meanwhile, signing off. Bye.